Okay, so um, this is... Uh, I don't know how this will work. Maybe it'll work, maybe it won't. But eh, eh, this is the boring solution to video editing, right? So what I'm trying to do here is I am trying to test the um, migration of the security ports from the front end to the back end, specifically on Merge Request. And I'm going to test it for container scanning, uh, DAST, SAST, and um, dependency scanning as well. So all of the ones that you see here. Now currently, uh, you can see the the feature flags are all set to false. So we're not using the API um, on, on this, this current screen. Uh, we're just using the, um, the, the, the front end logic, which is, is what's currently happening. But I have since set these feature flags uh, to true using chat ops. Um, this is on staging, by the way. Uh, yeah, I've set them to true using chat ops. So when I reload the page, we will stop using the front end and we will start using the backend reports, getting them from the API. So the purpose of this is to test whether everything's the same. Everything should render exactly the same. You should not see any differences. There should not be any missing data. There should not be any extra data. Every action should happen exactly the same. So what I did was right before I recorded this video, I recorded a different video where I checked um, that all of the information and everything was was already there uh, so I could get a comparison of, of what what we should be looking for when we run the tests um, on, on this version. So what I'm going to do now, um, actually first off, I'm just going to refresh this page and check that the feature flags are there. Um, Yes, good. Everything's set to true apart from license management, but that's fine because we, we're not testing that today. Um, so uh, a quick check, first of all, that they actually work. Um, we do have that dismissal. That's good. Um, ooh, that's dependency scanning. We've got SAS. We've got container scanning. Right. Hmm. This is already not looking promising, to be honest, but let's see. Um, I will hand you over to past Sam uh, very shortly. Where are we? Desktop one, screen recording. I'll put you on here because you are before. Oh, that's annoying. Ah. I was kind of hoping we could see these side by side, but I guess not. Um, ah. Okay, there we go. That'll do. That's that's close enough for me. Um, I don't know if you'll hear this other one, but well, whatever. We'll see. This 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 is this is how we how we do things here. Hopefully you heard in there. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Right, what are we checking first? Um, let's just pause this actually, because it's a video. Uh, right, so there's an issue straight away. Um, SAS has detected two new and one fixed, whereas it's detected four new and four fixed when it was doing the front end implementation. 19 new and two fixed, 22 new and one fixed. These numbers are all completely wrong. This one works, uh, DAST works, this one's been dismissed, but I'd do that later on in the video. So DAST and container scanning seem to be working so far. 
uh, SAST and dependency scanning do not work. I'll dig into that later. Let's just carry on and see what, what, what the other the other issues are. Right, what are we checking first? I can't remember. Um, s container scanning. Okay, good. Um, let's see. Let's pause this. Do we see the same thing? Description identifies severity, confidence, image, namespace, and links. Um, I'm just going to grab my notebook to make some notes here for container scanning. Um, everything seems to be the same. Medium, that registry is the same. The links are the same. The solution is the same. Everything looks the same. So. Okay, everything looks the same. Good. Model looks the same. Good. Right, let's continue. What do I do first? I think I dismissed the vulnerability. So we should get the same thing. Dismissed. Actually, there's our first thing. I don't know if that'll disappear. It did. Um, so when we dismissed the vulnerability here, I'll undismiss it and show again. Uh, we actually got the, the name of the dismissed vulnerability. When we dismissed it previously, uh, we didn't. It was broken. Um, so it, it is different. Um, but it's different because we fixed it. So I would argue that that's a good different <laughs> in this case. Uh, dismissed. Um, toast was fixed. Good, so we're fixing bugs. Uh, let's continue. Uh, I want to add a comment for dismissal. Let's say comment. Oh God, it's my keyboard that loud, sorry. Save comment. Yeah, same, same issue there. And it's there, we should be able to edit it. Oh, uh, oh that, that was me pointing out the error there that we've now fixed, so good. Um, and undo dismiss again should work exactly the same way and then what we're doing now dismissing with comment ah! add comment and dismiss good that works let's just open it and check we have the same pipeline id i think we did but let's just rewind a touch Oh, I'm not going too far. Uh, yes, we do have the same pipeline ID. Good. So that does work. But before that, something I've just noticed. Uh, let me just... Um, <laughs> so when I started this video, this container scanning uh, vulnerability was dismissed. Uh, sorry. Uh, when I ended the previous video, it was dismissed. So that should have still been dismissed uh, when I loaded this one. And it's not dismissed, which uh, that's an issue. Um, so previously dismissed vulnerability state. Uh, previously dismissed vulnerabilities. Um, uh, no longer dismissed. No longer dismissed. Okay, uh, there's a, <laughs> a lot more issues than I was expecting, but this this is good. This is why we do verification, right? Um, let's continue. Yes, let's check DAST. I don't know if you can hear the other video. Uh, it's not important. I'm not saying anything. Um, too interesting, DAST. So this one is dismissed and dismissed with comment from 15 minutes ago. So weirdly, um, moving on to DAST, DAST does, um, I'm gonna say does honor dismissals, which is weird. I would expect them either to all, under the dismissals or none of them. Um, very strange, very, very strange. 
Not sure how or why that's happening. Um, other good news. It looks like the data is all good. Uh, yeah, data is all good. The data is all good in Modo. Uh, everything, everything looks to be in order. We've got the right identifiers, severity, confidence. We've even got the instances, which I was a little worried about, uh, and the solution. Good, good, good. Um, so let's undo that dismissal for now. Um, <laughs> thank you, Sam. Uh, and oh, and then I dismissed it. Oh, which one am I doing again? Dast. So dismiss. Yeah, good. We've still got the the title. This is good. Um, I mean, I assume these are all going to work. But let's continue anyway. Yeah, dismiss. I've clicked the wrong one. This is the one I want. Dismiss with a reason. I can edit that reason. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. Ah, undo dismiss. <laughs> God, I'm fighting myself here. Right. Uh, dismiss with comment. Add comment and dismiss. Oh. Just hold on a second there. Um, something went wrong. What went wrong? Is this just a, a random bug? Uh, what I'm going to do, refresh. Expand the security report. We are looking at... Oh, wait. Which comments? These comments. Yeah, it's these comments. <laughs> it's not the merge across widget. It's different comments. As you were. Never mind. Continue, Sam. Oh, no. Wait. That's a lowercase u. That's weird. Uh, lower case U in unknown. Good. So we were getting some really, really consistent issues between the scanners. <laughs> we're not at all. We're not. They're really inconsistent. Why is this so different? Let's just crack on. So yeah, I did just mention that dependency scanning we have already tested, but um, this is the, the obvious issue that we've got the wrong amount of vulnerabilities. 22 new previously, and now there's 19 new. Um, now this is the same the same code base. Uh, we shouldn't be getting 22 new ones or 19 new ones. More the point, I think it's, it's more than likely that the wrong ones, the, the lower number, but... Oh, okay, right, let's just wrong number of vulnerabilities. Um, if I had the time, I would edit out the, the bits where I'm just writing notes, but eh, let's leave them in. Right, continue. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, right, okay, so I'm taking a look at the bottom of dependency scanning where we have, we have one fixed previously, now we have two fixed. That's strange. The vulnerabilities are different as well. They're totally different. Um, oh, we are missing where it is as well. Look at that. So I'm just getting the authentication bypass by incorrect, blah, 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 blah. But on uh, previously, I was getting where it was. So in yarn.lock, whereas none of these have the actual file name. So um, file is missing in description. Okay. Loads of issues. Um, I'm 
gonna click it. Go on, click it. Yes, good. Right, let's have a look. Let's see. This should be the same. It looks the same. Okay, so we have the file. Uh, so model has file name, but not description. Uh, some identifiers, it's good, it's very, we now have a undefined confidence that we didn't previously have. Um, confidence has been added, but yeah, like I said, um, adding data is, is probably fine, removing data is the issue, so I think, I think we can happily leave that in. Um, links, clever Sam too. That's uh, that's not me. Uh, okay, yeah. So they're the same. Um, upgrade Sam. All the solutions the same. The solution still works. Um, okay, everything else is fine. That's not too bad. It's just this file that's that's not um, it's not linking up there, which probably is the exact same reason why it's not showing in this list. Okay, uh, I just tried to close a model on a video. Play! Go on, thank you. Right, what's next? All the way at the top. Now, so here's a small issue. I, oh, I didn't mean to rewind that. Uh, so, the <laughs> annoyingly, the vulnerability that I've checked, you can see it's Prototype pollution attack in extend. Uh, we don't have that. Um, we don't have that vulnerability. So uh, I can't check that the data is exactly the same. Excuse me. I can't check that the data is exactly the same in the model because we don't have that vulnerability. Nightmare. So I'm going to just check uh, Growl and see if it's similar and we'll, we'll have to rerun this bear if it verification check later anyway so something worth knowing um, again we, the, the, it's linked there it's not linked here with the identifiers are fine it's a very we've got an added confidence so it's, it's basically the same thing as um, it's, it's got the same issues that the um, fixed vulnerability had so what I'm going to do because this one's just completely wrong anyway. I'm just gonna totally skip over where the whole adding and editing a comment thing. In fact, let's just check that that bit works before I do anything. Dismissed growl command injection in growl, that's fine. Um, all oh, right, in growl is just in the title, so it that's not added the file there, so it's in growl in package.json, but that's fine, right? Okay, so the toasts still work, um, <laughs> unless there is a undo dismiss comment. That's comment deleted. That's fine. I guess we don't have an undo dismiss toast. Fine, whatever. Maybe, maybe it's uh, the dismissed ones that aren't missed. Uh, sorry, I'll just write this down. Vulner uh, that don't. But yeah, so yeah, maybe um, because we dismissed prototype pollution attack, that's the one that's not appearing. Um, let me just test this theory a little. I'll go back to when we, oh, oh no, not that far. Oh, uh, yeah, so, uh, no, that's a load of nonsense. Oh, I don't know, maybe that's what's happened. Maybe it's not what's happened. It's something I can dig into later. This video is already quite long. Um, I'm still on dependency scanning. Yes. Ah. Um, 
regular expression denial of service. I think I've moved on to the next report here. Well, I mean, we can already see that um, <laughs> SAST has gone wrong for the same reason dependency scanning did. Uh, we've got a different lists of vulnerabilities. Um, in fact, SAST is even more wrong. Um, so SAST, oh my God, right. Okay, so SAST had four new and four fixed previously. Uh, now it's got two new and one fixed, which is radically different. Um, the rendering is is wrong. Uh, currently, we have medium high with uh, so the medium and high they don't have the correct capitalization. Uh, we don't have the file that they're in. Um, I think that's it. It just looks weirder. Uh, let me just write these down quickly. So wrong number of vulnerabilities file is missing in description the uh, capitalization capitalization in description is also wrong I mean, that's a minor issue, but it's still an issue. Um, okay, let's carry on. I think that's about it, really. It just looks worse than it is. Uh, let's pause there before I dismiss. What am I looking at? Predictable pseudo random number generator. <laughs> um, what? So it's fixed on one branch and it's an issue on the other one. That doesn't make any sense. Maybe it's just an issue with the dummy data. Um, whatever. Let's look at this one. <laughs> Uh, description's fine. File is that suffers from the same issue. So, modal has file but not link to it. Severity is fine. Confidence is actually so. Severity and confidence are actually rendering correctly in here, which is good. Um, yeah, again. That's the only issues there, really. Let's see if they're dismissing. I don't think it does anything fancy. Yeah, we get the name. Yeah, we get the name. Okay, good. Um, yep, yeah, right. Okay, so. <laughs> Jesus. Um, uh, let's get a. Dismissal is not persisted. Right, uh, I will I'll dig in a little bit more after this as, as to why this is failing, but for now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get this uploaded, and I'm gonna go get some dinner. Um, Cause, you know, I'm hungry. So dinner sounds like a good idea. Um, if you're watching this, um, pray for me. <laughs> There's a lot of issues here. I'll get them all written up um, and and figure out why they're happening and go from there. But uh, for now, um, yeah, thanks for watching, I guess. <laughs>